Welcome to the Trading with Venus podcast, where we help you establish strong trading habits, generate consistent profits, and create the lifestyle you desire for yourself and your family. Now your host, Raman Gill. Welcome to another episode of the Trading with Venus podcast. I'm your host, Raman Gill. Today we'll talk about a topic that I get asked about very often, and that is how do I trade if I have a full-time job? A lot of people are interested in Forex trading because they see the potential in it, but the big challenge that a lot of people have is that um, they have a full-time job. So how do you manage both responsibilities, your life, full-time job, and then a layering of Forex trading on top of that? The easiest solution that I have found for that is to take the trades based on a daily chart. When we're looking at higher time frames, we are also looking at larger take profit targets. So in Forex, you can trade whatever time frame you like. So you can trade a five minute chart, 15 minute chart, hour, four hour, daily, weekly, monthly chart, whatever you choose. Now, if you have a full-time job, it just makes sense to trade the daily chart. And the reason for that is that you're looking at your charts once a day. What I suggest is looking at your chart after the 5 p.m. New York close, so you get a full day's uh, price action in there. Based on how the daily candle closes, we can look for market direction. So if we have a good bearish candle close, then we can look for a follow through in the same direction. Now we do have to keep in mind the support resistance and trend lines and so forth, but this I have found to be a good good solution. So you're looking at only a one candlestick and based on that and support resistance, you can make a decision. So this is a very um, easy hands-off type of trading. So you would take a look at multiple charts and then out of those, we can just pick one or two charts that have good trade setups, whether that's bullish or bearish. And based on those trade setups, we will take positions uh, based on what the candlestick is, daily candlestick is telling us. If it's a bullish candlestick, we would go higher. We are looking for a long position. If it's a bearish candlestick, we're looking for uh, a short position and our profit target would just be the next support and resistance area that we are looking for. Now, of course, uh, depending on the technical analysis, we want to find trade where our risk to reward ratios make sense. Um, however, after we have set the positions, we just let them be and we will only take a look at these positions the next day. So it will take about maybe 30 minutes to an hour to do your analysis in the evening. And based on that, you can either put market orders or pending orders and then just let the trades run. This also keeps you away from meddling with your positions too much. Um, and this happens a lot where we'll take a position and then add as the price is going against us, just in the pullback, we can get a little fearful of the positions of the losses and we could click out of the positions. But this way, if you set your positions and don't really look at them too closely, it gives the positions room to actually play out and go in the profit. Whereas if you meddle with them too much or if you watch them too closely, you can get fearful and close the position out. This is a strategy that I highly recommend backtesting, so give it a try. I have done a lot of videos on this in our backtesting session, so you can go check those out on YouTube or in the Facebook page. But this is a really good strategy that I really love trading because it's simple, it's easy to use, and we are not meddling with our positions too much. And if you have a full-time job, you can do this after you come back from work in the evening, after you've spent time with the family and done um, taking care of other things that you need to do, you can spend about half an hour to an hour every day looking at the chart and based on that, you can take the place, the positions, and then you only need to look at, the, look at the, those positions when you come back the following day. So it's hands off, easy to do. So it still gives you that day trading. So you're not taking super long-term positions. It gives you uh, more profits because you're doing the day trades, but it does keep you away from being tied to your charts all day long. So that's the strategy I recommend. If you have a full-time job, give it a try, do a back test of it, and let me know what kind of results you get. 
That's it for today. Have a wonderful trading week and I'll see you next time. Thanks for joining us today. With much gratitude, your show host, Raman Gill.